Hey travelers, it's the OCD Traveler and I'm back again with another product review. This time someone sent me a complimentary bag, so let's dive in to see if you need it or not. Do you get as much satisfaction at creating your travel plans as you do from the actual act? Well, if so, you may be like me. So join me while I plan, travel, then repeat, I am the OCD Traveler. So I got an email at my email address, theocdtraveler at gmail.com from a company called Mateen. Mateen sells travel backpacks direct. They also sell school backpacks direct. They also sell through Amazon. They sent me their catalog and said, pick out any backpack or piece that I wanted and go ahead and review it. So I picked the Mateen travel backpack with toiletry bag. So that's what we're going to take a look at next. Um, I'm not being compensated for this whatsoever. They sent me an affiliate link. We'll talk more about that later if you want to support the channel or not. So let's dive right into an unboxing. I'll then pack it and give you my final thoughts and an overall rating on a five-point scale to decide if you need to own this or not. Now, I'll fully admit it. This is super nerdy. You probably didn't need this unboxing in your life, but after doing a bunch of different reviews, I was so excited that Mateen reached out and offered this to me, so I had to record the unboxing. Now, they did a really good job with the packaging, so much so that I've got this to 8x speed because it took me a while to get in there, but it is protected when it comes to your doorstep. All right, now that it's unboxed, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the accessories and features of the Mateen Travel Backpack, and we will start with the toiletry bag. You can see it matches. It is a fairly good size. It has a side compartment for things like your toothpaste, and then as you open it up, it is lined as well. There's nice little elastic pouches on the side. I'll show you that later, how it really helps to keep everything organized, uh, but pretty standard. I love the fact that it has this Pullman strap. So if you're taking Pullman luggage, you can put the backpack right over that strap. And speaking of straps, the backpack straps actually disconnect rather easily. You can see me clipping them in there. And then it does have a chest plate. But if you want to stow the luggage and don't want to deal with the straps, again, you just unclip them. You pull them back. You stick them back into that sleeve and you zip it shut. Pretty cool. Great back cushioning as well. Uh, you can see it's got a side carry handle. It's got a top carry handle. That's smart to have both. Uh, zipping open in this biggest pouch, that's great for an iPad, but really not big enough for a laptop. It's got pen compartments, little zipper pouches, uh, plenty of stuff to organize your little accessories like cords and credit cards. Uh, it does have what appears to be something like a sunglass pouch, but it is not lined for sunglasses. And all four corners are going to have these nice, easy compression straps with clips. Uh, and then one thing I was really surprised to see is a lifetime warranty card. Now, this bag goes for anywhere between $45 and $60. So the fact that you get a lifetime warranty says a lot about this company. Let's go ahead and get into the main compartment. This is where you're obviously going to store most of your clothing. You can see on the one side, there is a nice mesh zippered pocket. There it is a little bit clearer. Perfect, again, for cords, things that you can put in there pretty flat, maybe use as a little bit of compression. And then speaking of compression, uh, this is compressed down a little bit, so I will pull that up. You can see about four inches of space and a compression strap as well. One more look, you can see again, four inches if you pull that apart and this compression strap is nice and elastic and it's easy zipper, zip it up. And again, you got those four compression bands on the side that easily clip together, but there is the Mateen travel backpack. All right, so let's go ahead and pack this up. We're gonna start with the toiletry bag. If you don't have a perfume cologne atomizer, you can see me using it there. It's awesome for travel. I will link that in the description, but I put that in there first. You can see some more cologne kind of in that dry storage on the side. I've got my dude wipes. Hey, gotta stay fresh. I have my razor, brush, hairspray, two different types of gel. You can see I put in some lotion, some allergy pills, my deodorant, floss. I've got my electric toothbrush in there, but actually a lot of stuff that fits nice and neatly in the toiletry bag. And as I move over to pack the main backpack, you can see I've got some cords, pair of sunglasses, about two days worth of clothes, a couple of t-shirts, a couple of long sleeve shirts, some shorts. I've got a pair of jeans. I have a pair of shoes, some socks. I have my iPad, my Kindle, 
kind of a normal load. And I'll put this into a compression bag, but you can see me packing everything up and I will speed this up quite a bit because you don't need to see the packing part. Allow me to slow it down for one second. I want to show you how I'm organizing these cords in this zipper pouch, but I also want to show you this three in one charger. I will do my best to find one and link it in the description, but this is really sweet. It folds flat. You can charge AirPods, a Apple Watch, as well as your iPhone, all with one plug, which is awesome in hotels. And you can see it folds really flat with just one cord in that accessory pouch. So I just wanted to show you that really quick. And then we will zip that up. Now, again, I've got an iPad, a Kindle, and then that whole charging set in those cords. And then I will throw sunglasses up in that sunglass pouch. Again, usually you'll see those a little bit more felt lined. These are just the normal lining, but my sunglasses came out just fine. They are nice and protected. I am going to fold up my clothes and put it in this bag ale packing cube. It's a compression cube. I will link that in the description as well. I'll also put a link up for a review I did. These are really good. Uh, 25 bucks for a pack of, I think, four or five, but really compresses everything down. And now let's get it into the actual bag itself. And zipped up, and then we'll get those compression straps buckled up. But you can see plenty of space. Again, this is two days. I probably could have gotten three or four days. I get it set up for a backpack, and I am good to go. And go I did. I took this on a little weekend trip. Uh, I did rearrange a little bit, but one thing I wanted to call out before I wrap up this review is this bag is perfect for European travel. I took a Bang backpack, a very large 45 liter bag to Europe, and I was sweating it at the check-in counter. This will fit perfectly in the seat in front of you. It's great for Europe. So all in all, I was a really big fan of this Mateen backpack. First and foremost, what struck me about it is the fact that it has a lifetime warranty. Now, I don't think that they're telling you that this will stand up to everything for the rest of its life, but they do back the product. And you'd be amazed how many times I've used warranties on pieces of luggage. So that in and of itself is invaluable. Do me a favor before I go any further, hit like and subscribe. That's going to get other companies uh, products my way so that I can review them. But hit like and subscribe uh, just to support the channel. But let's go into our five point scale. So for this travel backpack, I'm going to review it on style design, the ease of use, practicality, and the overall cost. So starting with style, I just think it's a relatively stylish bag. I think the only thing that I would say is I would like it a little bit darker than this gray, but I like the color. It's pretty modern. Overall, I'd give this 4.5 out of 5 overall. And then the design, you know, the design has most of the elements you'd be looking for. The Pullman strap in the back. It's just missing a couple of easy things, like a hidden pocket back here would be great. Something a little bit more detailed for the laptop would be perfect. But design overall, you know, it's very solid. I, I like the, the clasping mechanisms, very easy to use. The other thing from a design standpoint is I do hate this rattling on the backpack straps. And I know that's a me thing, but hey, it's going to drive me crazy. So all in all, I would give it a four on a five point scale for design. From an ease of use standpoint, nice and easy. Zippers worked functionally. Um, really nothing stood out to me as being difficult, which I know sounds dopey, but there can be some things that are just not thought through well. The way that the straps kind of go in the back, if you wanted to stow it without using the straps, although the jingling's annoying, the actual ease of use is really, really smart. But from a practicality standpoint, if you're just going somewhere on a weekend, this bag is perfect. And the fact that it comes with you know, a toiletry bag that you can use or reuse or use for something other than toiletries in general. You could use this as a compression bag for socks and underwear and t-shirts. I think the practicality makes a heck of a lot of sense. From a cost perspective, the cost is really solid. So if you go directly to Mateen's website, you're going to pay $62.99. And if you use my affiliate link, you'll get 10% off. Um, pretty good value overall. So what, you're talking about $55 for the overall set. However, right now, if you use the link that I have in the description, Amazon has it with a $7 off coupon for $42.99, and you can get it from Prime. So cost for a bag with a lifetime warranty, uh, you know, two different pieces that you can use for a weekend. If you're going to pay 50 bucks delivered to your house with two days shipping via Prime, it's a five out of five. Shoot, it might be a six out of five. But overall, that's style 4.5, design 4. 
and then ease, practicality, and costs. I have all of those at a five. So overall, it got a 4.7. That's what I would give it. Oddly enough, if you go to Amazon, Amazon gave it exactly the same score, a 4.7. So this is a bag that you should look in. And then really, the whole Mateen collection, again, I'm not going to get paid for this. I love the fact that they sent me a bag. But what I love more is a lifetime warranty. Talked about that with Travel Pro. The fact that you can get that and get your bag replaced or at least credited towards a new bag, pretty awesome. So do me a favor, hit like and subscribe if you found this review helpful. Really would love you to subscribe to this channel. And if there's another bag or another company that you think that I should review, put it down in the comments. And if you have a product by Mateen that you like, let me know. I know they do school backpacks as well. We're kind of in that season right now as I tape this. But overall, really good experience. Like and subscribe. And until next time, continue to plan, travel, and repeat. I'm the OCD Traveler.